Okay. One last quick video for the night, and then I promise I'm done. Because I have to upload a whole bunch of different things. But I had to show you the rose that came off my rose bush today. I picked it, and it's so pretty. And I want to get a good viewing of it before it starts to wilt. My plan is to use it to dry it. And um, I've learned, I watched a video on how to make candles and how you can put the rose petals into your candles and, you know, buy your essential oils and put them into there as well. Or you can make, like, you know, sachets and, um, you know, put your scents into the sachets and as gifts and things like that. But anyway, it's just the prettiest pink rose. Of course, it looks orange from here. The lighting is not very good. I wonder if I could take it somewhere else and show it to you how pretty it is. It's just, it's, yeah, there we go. It's very, very pink and it's very pretty. And I've got four more rose buds on my bush. I'm so excited. I had two roses, rose uh, bushes, and one of them just like died. I don't understand what the deal was. I got tuberose here, and when it starts to wilt, I'm going to pull it out in time to dry it. And I've got these big, beautiful sunflowers. And I'm, I'm going to dry those petals too, I think. And put them into, I don't know, something special. You know, like I said, candles or who knows. My herbs are over here drying. And they smell very, very good. My uh, lavender, I really actually need to put that into the jar. The sage is almost dry. I'm drying some basil. And I'm attempting the cilantro drying. I want to see what happens with that. Um, I'll show you guys another video on how to hang and dry your own. It's real simple. so easy to do. I'm hoping tomorrow to get some more la uh, lavender. Anyway, um... That's it from uh, the Cottage of Grace, and uh, hope you all have a good night. And if you're in a cold area like we are tonight, which is great because it's great for sleeping, then cover up and sleep well. Bye. Blessings.